In this episode, we're talking about relationships and money. So we see a lot of single people come and talk to us and we also see couples come talk to us. And it's very interesting to figure out how different people manage their money. So some couples, they like to do everything together and they have joint bank accounts and all the money is in one pool and that is separated in terms of how they like to spend their money. Other people are a little bit different and they have one partner has their bank account and their savings and one thing separate and the other partner has the same on their side and they don't share bank accounts at all. And there's no right or wrong answer when it comes to this. It's what works for you and what you're comfortable in. But what I would suggest is if you're getting into it, into a new relationship or maybe you're in an existing relationship and you don't share finances is to just have the conversation with your partner about how they're going financially. So if you don't share bank accounts and you don't know what your partner has or doesn't have, then it's really important that you just figure out what they have and make sure that they're doing okay financially. So they might be doing fine and it's just a matter of just asking the question and making sure that's okay. But too often we see especially new couples getting into a new relationship where one partner has been hit financially and they have a lot of financial debt and the other partner might have some savings and then they get together and it affects their relationship. So money is not a very nice topic to talk about when it becomes especially new relationships or at any time at all money is not a nice topic but it's important that you have these conversations and figure out how your partner's going financially and making sure that they're not sitting with any debt that's gonna affect you in the long term. So we see this too often that everyone thinks that everyone's okay, everyone thinks that, well, he earned a lot of money, so we must be doing okay. We've got we each got a little bit of savings in the bank. Let's go and apply for a home loan. You get to the bank and you figure out that your partner has a large hex debt, has a personal loan that he didn't tell you about or she didn't tell you about and maybe they've got a couple of credit cards that built up over the years that they were too embarrassed to talk about or too embarrassed to bring up especially in a new relationship and this has a big effect in terms of what you can borrow and what your future looks like.